Hi everybody, it's Heather Kay from uh, Cupcakes Anonymous and today is the 100 uh, days weight loss journey and today is January 30th so I've been at this for 30 days and you guys already heard how well I've been doing because I've been pretty much telling you every day how I've been doing. Um, I had a little bit of a breakthrough, went to town, bought myself some stickers, of course there's only Valentine stickers out which is fine by me, I love stickers. Like, remember when you're like a kid in primary and they put like a little sticker on your, um, your work? Let me just put a little heart here. I know I'll make myself, um, uh, little, I love you. So here's my notes. Little sticker. Remember that? How much we loved it? Well, I don't know about you, but I've always loved it. All kids love stickers and I guess I consider myself to be young at heart. So today is eat food to fuel your body, not your emotions. Um, I had another difficult evening. I went to bed early. Um, I've been trying to analyze my eating patterns and why I'm feeling this way after almost a month. And other than being bad and going out and eating out and all that stuff, that you can't control what kind of food you've been having, I've been having my own creations. And uh, when I when I thought about it, I remember I, I did actually see a nutritionist recently on my new journey, and um, it turns out that. I, I gave up um, beef and I gave up chicken. Um, I, I hung around seafood. Basically trying to have, not have anything with eyeballs and a mother, which is, um, I don't know, I just kind of got grossed out. And if I, if I did want to eat hamburger, I wanted real hamburger, not some of this burgers that you get. And I just, you guys already heard me in other videos where I do not want to be a garbage can. So if the burgers are no good, I'm trying to find places. If I had to eat out, where would I want to eat? And for the most part, for now, on this journey, I need to be making my own meals, and which is what I have. I got my own supper here. It's cool it off here on the side. And you don't really, I don't think you want to hear about my food until I'm successful. So I'm just talking about this 100-day journey, um, which to me has been difficult. Like I said, I went to bed early last night. Um... I started having my cravings again, and I don't know if it's cravings or if it's emotion. Um, I was one time told by a nutritionist, not a nutritionist, but a, a fitness coach, that what I have is nothing more than a, a bad habit. And of course, you know, it takes like 30 days to break a habit, and here I am at day 30 when I'm like an aha, I'm having one of these aha moments. So if you can see it right there, see that? Uh, let's go this way, that there, sticker right there with a little happy face. I give myself a sticker and I was hoping to have flowers but all I found was these ones it's, these are my daily reward stickers like I unfortunately I still have my stars represent my water these represent my meals and if I have um, a small gem like that that represents that I skipped um, a snack and sometimes I'll skip a snack if I get up too late and I'm having a late breakfast and make my way to lunch and you know or late dinner or whatever so so I'm trying to be mindful of that um, the other thing is my exercise goal is a big gem here sometimes if I work out twice like not work out but trust me I'm not working out if I'm do um, something extraneously different than I normally do or go for a couple of walks I'll put like a little heart sticker on it it's kind of like a bonus um, so anyway so so what I did uh, last night is when I have these stickers on there and if I in the evening after all my meals are done after all my water's done and I have to be true to myself that if I decide to go eat something, and that counts the licks, the bites, and the taste, right? I have to take my sticker off. And, and I felt after a good days, um, giving it everything I got, the end of the day, you don't want to sabotage yourself. Because I've been one of these people in the past that can sabotage myself in an evening with a whole day of calories. Like, I, you know, I guess we're here watching these videos for a reason. We love food. And I liked it back in the days when I didn't like food, but I love food. And so that's the kind of switch I'm making. Instead of buying food that makes me unhappy, I want to make it um, healthy, satisfying, and makes me happy. So there are better um, diets, or I should say diet. There's other um, cultures and food and stuff that we could be trying. So that's kind of why I'm trying um, the being vegan and, and just trying that. But like I said, I'm not used to having alternative sources of protein which is what I have to figure out 
those kind of amounts. Anyway, I think I'm getting a little bit of a cold here. I've been around a lot of people with flus and stuff like that. So anyways, that's all I want to say about that. I actually made it to the night, got my sticker. Let's see if I get my sticker tomorrow. Hey, you got to do what works for you. And for me, nothing was working. So I started this board. I, 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 uh, I chart how much water I'm having. I chart whether I have a meal or not. Like these, these stickers all mean something to me. So, um, I had a difficult night and I survived it. I did have two uh, bottles of carbonated water, um, just because I needed something. And that to me was my escape from just drinking old plain old water. So that's three cups. I got to finish that today too. So anyways, that's it. I'll see you tomorrow. Like subscribe and all that stuff.